I realize reality programming covers a broad range, but the shows I find really awful are Jersey Shore and Bridezilla. I watched Jersey Shore after reading an article about its popularity, and I was just appalled at the people and uh, what the show was about. It was just degrading, I thought, to uh, anyone who participated in it or watched it. And then the other show, I really wonder about why anyone would do it or why anyone would buy time on it or, to a lesser extent, why anyone would watch it, is Bridezilla. Why would you be on a show and show your most obnoxious, self-centered characteristics. It's just an entertainment genre I don't understand at all, but then again, it isn't designed for people in my demographic. Reality shows certainly can grab important demographics, young people, and they grab a lot of attention, and maybe they get a lot of publicity because of the type of content. We use the one term to describe so many different types of reality shows. So certainly there are a lot of people that can look at celebrity-based shows like um, the Kardashian sisters and say, what is the appeal for this? You know, who are these people? They're not really talented. They, they just happen to be in, in a family that has a lot of media connections and they, then they're beautiful and that's why we want to follow them. But if we lump that as reality TV into the same category as American Idol, does that really, does that really work? American Idol is one of the most popular shows uh, for over the last many, many years, still is this year. There's probably no one reason why it's popular. I think one of the reasons is just simply that we have a lot more of it.